a young man here, you are a breadwinner in your family. But things are not going your way. You are facing disappointments as it is. It's as if you will lose the source of your livelihood. Come here, let us pray together. Allow God to restore you. You are a breadwinner. You are a breadwinner. Allow God to restore you. Things are not going your way. Yes. Right now you are about to lose what you are doing for a living. Yes. I'm, I'm an operator at the mine in Delmas. But right now your job is at stake. Yes. And you are saying to yourself, God, if I lose this job, if I lose this job, let me tell you, the devil is a liar. You will not lose this job. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. My brother, don't cry. You will not lose your job. This is a plot again. There's somebody who wants your position and they are plotting against you so that you can leave. You will not lose this job. Promotion is coming your way. In Jesus' name. There is another person here. Each time a breakthrough is coming or you have a promise for something, you dream somebody touching you. And once that person touches you, it's gone, it's over. You won't get it. Come closer. Come closer. Let me ask, are both of you married? Yes. You're married? You're married? Yes. Did he finish? Not yet, but he's going to finish in June. He's going to finish in June? Yeah. Each time you are pregnant, you get a miscarriage. It's you I'm looking for. Out in Jesus' name. Come out. Come out, you demon. Come out. What are you doing? Yeah? Huh? What are you doing? Why are you doing? Why do you, you don't want her to have children? So you don't want her to have a baby boy? Yes. That's why you are making all these miscarriages. Yes. Do you know? Are you hearing what this demon is saying? They don't want her to have a child because the child will become a pastor. In Jesus' name. Out! Leave this woman. Jesus name she must have a baby and give birth to this baby in Jesus name come out come out out in Jesus name Jessica my prefer you you have something that moves in your stomach hmm very true. You have something that keeps moving in your yes, stomach. Every time. And every time it starts moving, that's where this, this miscarriage yes, happens. Very true. You know why? Do you know why? No. Because they don't want you to get married. There are things that this man has promised you if you have a child, I will do this and this and this and this. Hmm? I don't know. Hmm? I didn't know. But this thing. In Jesus' name. Out. Jesus.
Jesus' name. My sister, you are free. Your husband will finish Lobola and you will have children. You will never hear this thing anymore. Are you hearing me? There's a person I called, I said, each time you are at the point of breakthrough, you always dream a person and this person, once this person touches you, it's over. It's finished. Come, I pray for you. At times you see a hand, you don't see the person. Yes. You see a person, a hand that comes and touches you. Yes. And once it touches you, it's over. Yes. You know why this hand touches you? I don't know. They say you have a lot of money. Yes. My family, they tell me that. You have a lot of money. That's what they are saying. That's why this hand always comes and touches you. And the truth is, it's there, but it's not there. Yes. Hmm? Yes, true. This hand must leave you today in Jesus' name. Touch your stomach. You are free in Jesus' name. All of you, you dream someone. Place your hands on your stomachs. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Your spirit. Out! Out! In the name of Jesus. You did the spirit. Out! The name of Jesus. Come out. Come out. Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. You are free in Jesus' name. There is somebody who is sick. You are sick. You have, it's as if you have ions. I'm not talking about mavuma. The way your legs are painful, it's as if you have ions. And they are very painful. Come, let us pray together. The power of God is here to heal you. When last did you go home? Uh, last of last week. Mm. Mm. Can we normalize as children of God that before you travel home, you receive prayer? Can we normalize that? It's not that pastors are trying to control. Can we just normalize that before I go home, let me go receive prayer? Because people at home, to be honest, not particularly your family, they are not happy with you. When about Topile Maudu? Hmm? And they are doing this so that you can lose your job and you come and stay at home, do nothing. Come, my brother. You are healed. Bring it. Come out. Come out. Come out. Come out. Jesus' name. Come out, come out, come out, evil spirit. Leave those legs, leave those legs. I put fire in those legs. I put fire in those legs. Out in the name of Jesus. Leave those legs. In Jesus' name. Can we stand and we pray for the last time before we pray for you? There is, there is someone you want to get married and your finances are not financing. They are not coming all right. You want to marry finances. Something always happens. And it takes away the money. Ladies one side, men one side. Each time you want to marry, something happens. You end up taking the money for marriage and you use it. 
Let us stretch our hands to them. Jesus name. My brother in the red t-shirt. You is not only money, but it's also family issue involved. Okay. Hmm? Yes. It's also family issue involved. Yes, I don't know how. That's why it's becoming double difficult. Okay. In your family, you have that thing of stagnancy. Come again? In your family, you have a spirit of stagnancy. You don't cross a certain line. Okay. People in your family, they struggle for marriage. Yes, it's true. It doesn't come easy. It's true. Even if they manage to marry, it always ends in disaster. That's true. God is setting you free today. In Jesus' name. Some of you, you are going to get jobs that are going to bring money for you to marry. Please, when you get the money, go and marry. Are you hearing me? My brother, hi. Be careful of your friends. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. I wish when you want to marry, you don't, you don't consider their opinion. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes. Because it's all, not all that glitters which is gold. Yes. Okay? Yes. Marry somebody who has a good character. Yes. Hmm? Yes. We marry character. We don't marry shape. Yes. Does it make sense? Yes. Okay. Where is the person who promised to marry you? It's that they is. Oh, it's him? Yes, it's him. Oh, I, don't come back. Don't come back. Bye bye. Oh, it's, do you want him to marry you? Yes. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Will you be a good wife? Yes, I will be. I don't trust you. You know why I don't trust you? Can I tell you why I don't trust you? Yes, you may. When I prayed for you, the reason why I'm talking to you out of every woman is that I wanted to tell you, be careful you don't lose the person you have because of character. Yes. Character. Yes. Fukuchakam. Yes. I have a low shading if I like that. Don't do the, you'll be a good wife. Hmm? Don't cry. I get I always say it's not all wars that are meant to be fought. I understand why. I get You will see you will get married. I get God loves you. In Jesus' name. And God has healed your heart. Forget about the past. Hallelujah.